हेलो एंड वेलकम बैक टू अनादर एक्साइटिंग सेशन आई एम होस्ट महेश कारिया यू वॉचिंग मी ऑन यूट्यूब ना एंड टुडे आई एम गन टेक यू थ्रू द एक्सटेंशन ऑफ वी एस कोड विच इज मोंगोडी बी दैट आई जनरली यूज इन माई एवरी ट्यूटोरियल सो लेट्स डीप डाइव इन टू इट सो यू कैन डाउनलोड दिस एक्सटेंशन बाय क्लिकिंग ऑन दिस मोंगोडी बी फॉर वी एस कोड क्लिक ऑन इंस्टॉल इट विट take some time till then we'll open uh, our terminal uh, i'm assuming you already have mongodb uh, installed in your system if you don't have it it's completely fine uh, for now i'll be using docker hyphen hyphen let's say run hyphen hyphen name will be my mongo db okay in detach mode we'll publish this in 27017 colon 27017 uh this one is external port and this one is a port of container you can change this to anything okay it's all up to you but for now i'm using standard port and image will be mongo mongo latest it will fetch automatically so if you have docker available inside your system then you can hit this command okay apart from that uh, let's let's you need to start docker first i guess so i already have few containers over there we'll see uh the next thing you can directly download mongodb as well it's all your choice okay so this is ready to use so let's see mongodb ha you will get this one icon okay now you can uh, click on add connection okay and uh, it's taking time to start docker it's fine okay then only you can hit this command okay the linux container wsl2 starting okay fine okay now you can hit uh this you can click on this okay or you have another option if you don't want to install you can click here on uh, create cluster as well it will uh, automatically open uh redirect you to the sign up page where you can uh, create your uh, cluster for 500 mb of free storage it's all up to you okay no, i'm not going to use it for now for now i have a local host let's go with the mongodb colon slash slash localhost colon 27017 it will not okay it's connected okay something is running inside my system uh let it be so after that the very next step you can use this thing like uh, you can see guys uh here are all the databases that i am working on okay this is my blog and you can see like this okay you can click on it you can see this thing so this is a mongodb client apart from that for any testing or you want to play around with it you can click here okay you can simply uh, use your mongo queries here let's save uh, i'm saving this here like uh, let's say test or youtube dot mongodb okay and uh, i'll be using the uh, commands like use youtube let's say okay and uh, after that now uh, we can say db dot users let's say dot insert one for now i'll try to insert something mahesh kariya email will be mahesh at gmail.com which is not official email password let's say mahesh at one two three okay and uh you can use dot find as well okay db dot users dot find like this you can see this icon over here you just need to click here 
okay it will ask that you want to run against 27017 yes it will ask every time that do you want to execute this thing or not okay uh, so yeah you can see it's created and now we can see the output as well okay and let's try to update some things okay we can use update one i guess let's try to use update one where uh, you need to use dollar set i guess i'm not sure but yes it should work dollar set and here we'll use like id underscore id colon let's say object id that we have this one okay it's like a where condition and here we go here you just need to paste and let's not use insert this time and okay i need to update the data as well so let's try to this at add symbol so we'll know that everything is working fine and here we go everything is working fine so now we can do one more thing as well let's try to delete this thing okay so for delete as well we'll use delete one method instead of update we'll use delete de l e t e delete one and uh this time i'll remove this thing as well and let's see i don't like this pop-up there might be inside extension setting you can do something with this we'll see that later okay so something went wrong i guess uh delete one is not working i don't know why uh but uh, delete one it should work i guess this should not be there okay let's try this again please let me know inside comment box if you find something inside setting definitely it will be easy one i guess so delete one is there update is there insert and find that we have seen now uh, you can use uh, there are various things like db dot users dot insert one insert mini i guess which will be array of something like this so you can play around with this as well so this is a very cool mongodb extension instead of using uh, uh some thing uh some other tools it will be light and e easy to use i guess uh so you can use like this let's try this out and uh, here we go so everything is working fine you can use it i guess so thank you very much all of you guys uh please let me know inside comment box if you like this video and please if you haven't uh, subscribed already you can uh, hit on subscribe button as well so thank you so much bye bye take care